Okay. I think from my aspect, it's like honesty, integrity, and fairness. So I look at that going with some of the issues tonight. I mean, you can obviously both see both sides of the issue with folks that want to split their land up, the neighbors that may or may not want it. So it's looking at that from a, okay, what's the fair thing to do? What's, and from an honesty and integrity standpoint, how do you make sure with that couple that comes in with that issue and wants to split up their land, what do we do from our precedence for next time? So I would look at that from, hey, if you're honest, you have act with integrity and you're fair, that feels like those would be three traits that I would carry forward into the board. Can I ask him, huh? ask him the next question first? So he's... Do it? Okay, next yeah. yeah. Okay, I'll, I'll let you go. The next question, she wants me to take... Take turns. <laughs> what, <laughs> Take do you, fair, what do you expect, expect to achieve for yourself in the city by being on the planning and zoning? What's that now? How do you expect? No. What? What do you expect to achieve for yourself and the city by being on planning and zoning committee? So I moved into now then uh, a year ago Thanksgiving Day. So fairly new to the area. Uh, I was in Rogers for 20 years. Uh, when we started in Rogers, I was actually part of Hassel Township. So Hassan Township was the last township in Hennepin County. It was annexed into Rogers, and uh, there's a ton of changes that were made. And what used to be a rural living in Hassan Township became um, more of a cluster living, so we decided to move. So as we moved up to now then, what I would like to keep in now then is more of the rural frill that's up here that we used to have in Rogers. So I guess that's my interest. I've been to more board meetings in now then in 12 months than I ever was in Rogers in 20 years. <laughs> Me too. Okay, Al. Or, or does it just seem like that? <laughs> 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 Yeah, what do you expect to achieve for yourself in the city by being on the planning and zoning committee? Well, this isn't for myself. It's for the citizens who know that. That's the way I look at it. That's why I'm on uh, road and bridge, for the citizens who uh, know that. I've been here 39 years, going on 40. I love it here. I love the country. It, it's a nice place to live. A lot of nice people. And I'm doing this for the citizens, not for myself. Okay. What, Al, what challenges do you anticipate with being the plan, on the Planning and Zoning Committee? What, what, no? What challenges do you anticipate with being the plan, on the Planning and Zoning Committee? Uh, the biggest problem, and I, I have to look at her for... <laughs> What's going to be illegal? You know, something That's quite a pregnant illegal. pause there. But <laughs> <laughs> that was a long pause. Now. <laughs> I've been picked on a lot. <laughs> I can you you, you did hear his last part. What's legal? <laughs> yes, I, I did. I'm teasing. Okay. I think from my aspect is um, you know the the either the knowledge or the education gap on just what are the ordinances ordinances and how do we apply those so it would be closing that gap on um, what what's the president what's the ordinances that we have in place and now then and then how do we act on those with consistency fairness um, and integrity as we go forward okay I'll ask you the next question highlight for us what you know about the city of Nolan and why you would be interested in being on the planning and zoning so I like um, I don't have 39 years here. I have a year here. I think from my aspect of why we moved up here is because it does have a r very rural feel. Uh, we have, uh, I live about a thousand yards that way. Uh, <laughs> we have just over 12 acres. We have seven horses. We enjoy that. We live on a gravel road. We love the rural feel. We got involved with this planning and township and zoning when we got into, hey, what's going across the street from uh, tiny home that we talked a little bit about earlier to when's the next bills going in to is the place going to be zoned commercial in our area or not so um, I think those are the aspects that I like about now then from a history standpoint uh, I don't have the history of 39 years I have the history of 12 months being here we love the school district we like the fact that it's a small field I like the fact that I can drive my gator up here and get gas and stop at the uh, uh, bootleggers on the way back, so I, I like that aspect of it. So, love all those aspects of it. Want to keep the small town feel. 
um, want to help make sure that as we do decide to grow, um, that we grow in some manner that's consistent with where the place has been from a historical standpoint with what the residents feel like they want. Okay, Al, I'll repeat the question because it's pretty long. Highlight for us what you know about the city of Nelvin and why you would be interested in being in the planning and zoning. Why do I... I didn't catch that last part. Why you would be interested... Why you'd why you be interested in being on the planning and zoning. Highlight the, for us what you know about the city of Nelvin and why you would be interested in being on the planning and zoning. Uh, <laughs> I don't know how to answer that. I don't think I heard your, your question clearly. Highlight for us what you know about the city of Nalden and why you would be interested in being on the planning and zoning. Well, probably the same reason when I first moved here, I was, you were around here when I was kind of active and I had a bad monitor on me because I guess I caused too much trouble around here on the township. I wanted to, uh, I enjoyed now and then the people in it, and I've always wanted to help out here. I've been, well, I've been a judge, election judge for 10 years here. But it's always, my idea is always get involved with local government. I guess that. Okay, we'll go to the next question we'll ask you. What makes you think you would be the best candidate for the planning and zoning? What? No. What makes you think you would be the best candidate for being on the planning and zoning? I don't know if there's always a best candidate. Is there really a best candidate? Uh, Sell us. I think anybody. <laughs> Sorry. If they're willing and smart enough and got a brain, can work planning and zoning if they are, if they want to do it, and if they enjoy working with people and enjoy contributing to society. Okay. Yeah, it's that woman right there. <laughs> what about? <laughs> uh, I, I think from a from an education and a background and some of the experiences I've had working with. Caterpillar and some of the facility leadership that I've had make me a pretty good candidate for this. Um, I think from uh, some of the experiences I've had with Rogers and seeing what I felt was, hey, is this the direction Rogers and Hassan Township wanted to go? I've kind of seen that, lived in that, and we decided to move away from that. And it feels like we have the same opportunity as Rogers looked at 20 years ago when I moved into Hassan Township. Um, so I kind of look at that experience that I had from Rogers Kind of a clean slate again and i want to help direct that as we move forward so i think the experiences that i've had in the back i think the education that i've had and i think the experiences i have running the uh, facility down at caterpillar make me a good candidate for position okay uh the next question i'll ask you is do you have time to go to regular monthly meetings and other meetings relating to being on the planning and zoning it's once a month for two and Three hours. <laughs> so yes, I think uh, from a um, edge from a time commitment. If you're interested in it, we'll make time for it, right? Okay. Hell, I got all the time in the world. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, re I'm retired. <coughs> I'm retired too, but I don't have all the time in the world. <laughs> he lives for these meetings. Okay. <laughs> Here's a lot of homework, right, Dale? <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Okay. okay, we'll go to the next question now. Did you review the planning and zoning city code and the code of conduct as listed for part of the application for appointment to planning and zoning? Do I know it? Did you did you review it? Yes, I did. Okay. 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 Um, I have not reviewed it. You haven't reviewed it? I'd suggest heavily that, I, I don't know if you, did you receive it or not? So at the last meeting, Jeff urged me to, to review it. If, if it's online, I have not went online and reviewed it. Okay. I don't have a copy of it, Good. a hard that, copy. Because that's real important to look at that. And uh, I, we talked earlier about, hey, from a knowledge gap, that's one of the, that's the gap that I, that I need to close. Okay. Now I'm going to open it up for any other questions. Mr. Chair, I would just, just say, just as uh, 
it's, it's the commitment of time. Liz did bring it up. There is homework, though. It's going out to seeing the sites where the questions are coming up and reviewing a packet like we got tonight. Yeah, that's not. I just don't see that as a gap. Yeah. You can do it at work, I do. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, Commissioner Pearl, do you have a question to ask? Do I? Yes. Of these candidates. I did write out the questions. Yes. Um, have either of you ever been on a on a committee that is bound to these, like the parliamentary procedures where we have the chair and all this? I've got a cold in my ears. That's why I'm having trouble hearing. Okay. No. Did I say that correctly? It's parliament procedure. So I was asking if you've ever been on a committee where you do have um, been bound to the parliament procedure like we are up here. Well, we do the road and bridge. Okay. Well, that's what I'm... Yeah. Yeah, the foundation board is the same setup. Okay. And park and rent. <coughs> okay, anybody else have any questions they want to ask? These two gentlemen. Do you guys know everybody's last name who lives here? <laughs> Because yeah. I don't. <laughs> I use addresses. It's a it's a new concept. I do not. <laughs> well, me either. Ask Carol. <laughs> they live here now or have in the past. He's the. Uh, I want to know Al, He's the encyclopedia. if you're the reason we have all these holes in our tar roads around here. <laughs> <laughs> if you're chairman of the road and bridge, you've got, you got problems. Some I can help you out. If I can't drive my tractor down the road and open it up without losing the whole toolbox, Bernard, I kid you not. I agree. I agree. No, this is what this is right on the tar. You guys, they've let the the roads go just terrible this year. We've got holes all over that road. They did. We're not patching none of them. This is road and bridge topic. It's actually if planning and zoning. Planning and zoning, but this is this is where we're going. What we got to do? Well, we got to do the thing. We're going to make a. We have to make a decision between one of these two candidates who we're going to recommend to the council to uh, be on the planning and zoning. So I'm open for a motion for somebody to make a motion at this time for a recommendation of one of these gentlemen. Oh, I, thought I thought we, we would vote, vote for I that. I thought we did this secretly too. We cannot, that's, that's illegal. We can't do it. What? It can't be a secret vote. So do I get to go home? Because I was secretly voted. I was too. When? Since when? No, I, 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 I thought, because this is public, the people has a right to know who, how we vote. Mm, I don't think so. Yeah, I remember it was a double vote that night too, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. Yeah. And they had to do their piece of paper on which one they wanted. Right, Jeff? I don't or know. something about it, but I didn't research it before the meeting. Well, we don't have to do. Well, I guess. Yeah, we have to make a recommendation to the city of one of these guys to be uh, on the. Uh, on but the does does our vote? Huh? It, does our vote go over the city councils on this? No. No. No, they make the final decision. They make the so, final so decision. So, in other words, it's just a, a recommendation. It's a recommendation. Uh, really not nothing that's important okay so you can make your recommendation if you know um, if you want to do a paper ballot because the actual votes can be by the city council and we have to express publicly okay we need uh, one two three four five I think everybody needs the same color <laughs> No, there's just two, there's that into four of us. One, two, three, five. Five. Walter, he five. left. I'm he pretty sure Walter quit. Five. Boogie. So you put Al down or Jesus? Put everything. Yeah. How do you yeah. do that? He boogied as soon as we uh, ended that last public hearing before we even motioned. Is that his book? Yeah. I thought he went to the, the restroom actually, but he did not come back. Somebody okay, I'll grab him. One, two, three, four. Three, you got one? Yeah, we got our money. Oops. In the city, we got the vote to go to the roadkill guy. All right. He won like $400 and some thousand dollars. Oh, he did. 
No, not in the lottery. Harold, you won, would you write uh, your vote on the paper, please? The lawsuit against I've the state of Anoka. Oh, you got it. You got it. Huh? <laughs> I ain't got a pencil, so I don't have to write. Then, yeah. after you I'm vote, already. pass your votes over to our, our clerk here. Yep. Jason or Al? Jason or Al. Pass this way. Or give him to Lori. Oh, yep, Lori. Lori. Give him to Lori. Oh, he's stuck in the middle. Harold, my dear, we'll wait on you. Go. You read it. Hey, you all, you all done, Harold? We're waiting, oh, for, we're waiting on you. Yeah. <laughs> Harold's coming in the rear, so it's me yep. today. Yeah. What are you going to To the blood product. He has a vote already? Okay. 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 I'd love her to say the winner. There you go. Who, who, who got it then? So the majority of the votes went to Jason. Okay, I'll make one other comment. There's going to be another opening on the planning and zoning shortly. I can't, it's not official yet, but anyway, there's going to be one soon. In a way, uh, uh, one, one decision we've got to make tonight, are we going to have a meeting in December? Can, can we is, is back there? up to who is leaving? Uh, well, you? No. I don't, oh. Um, um, okay. I'll announce it later. Okay. Um, December 26th is the date yeah. to be, but are we going to... I'll make a motion that? to not have that meeting. <laughs> Liz, is anything pending? That's what I was going to ask. No, there's oh, not. Oh, sorry. There's I, no, there's I typically there's... tell people okay. they got to wait till January. That would be great. <laughs> we have a sec. We have... I'll make a motion to... I'll, I'll second that. Okay. To move. Commissioner Burroughs, second it. Any discussion? All in favor, say aye. 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 I have another announcement to make. This is our last meeting for our, our clerk. She's leaving us. And so I, it's a shock to most of us. I just found out the name. Did you bring us presents? You just bring me presents. I was unaware. You yeah, knew. I didn't. <laughs> Love it. And, uh, also, uh, we have another member. It's not official yet, but we'll be, we will, this is our last meeting too here with us. And it, it, it's not official, so I can't. Uh, do, did we make a motion to <laughs> recommend? Jason to this council as a committee member. There you go. Do we have to make a motion for that? Yes. Okay. And I second it. I will make yeah. Okay. That was my motion, I guess. <laughs> so it's up to the vote. Yes. All in favor say aye. 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 Okay. One more motion left. Mr. No. Wait, please. Wait. Perfect. I would like to thank Lori. She's been a wonderful addition to the city. And I'm gonna miss her for one. And I know a lot of other people. She's done a great job organizing and it's so professional, so friendly, so everything. We get everything We're so really going to miss you. Thank you. We are. We are, we are going to miss you, Lori. You were a valuable asset to us. I'm glad you're still living now. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Let's go off the air. Okay, so I'll make a motion to adjourn. Okay. Second. Oh, yes. Thank you. Um, oh, All right. All right. Thank you. So, well, when does the city council meet and discuss?